hello guys this is Satosh and welcome to tech design so in the last tutorial we are discussed on uh, move face command in uh, synchronous modeling so in this tutorial I am going to show you how we can use an offset command so as you can see here this is an offset command so we can just go to offset command and select a face here and uh, there is a only one uh, distance is the only option we have in offset so you can just give the offset so as you can see here once you give the offset so the face will move and if you want to move this face you can just move that this face as well and uh, you can just move whatever the faces you want along any direction so now you may have a question that so even in the move face also we can able to do all these features so why there is a separate command for this so there is an uniqueness uh, in this face so when we have a holes or any cylinder so if you want to change the diameter of the cylinder or a hole uh, you can able to do using a face uh, you know offset uh, command so now what we can do is we'll just select this face as you can see here this face is selected now when you select a similar kind of faces in a move face command so it will be asking you the direction or a vector along which direction you want to give the distance but here in this case as you can see here so the dis uh, there is no need to provide any uh, you know direction so it is already asking for a distance so we can just provide a distance over here so as you can see here either you can <coughs> sorry guys either you can increase the uh, you know uh, whole volume or else you can decrease the whole um, diameter so this is how uh, it works so it works on even uh, this cylinder as well so in the same way the how uh, it works on the holes so either you can increase it or you can uh, decreases so this is what the difference between the move face and then offset face guys hope you understand this uh, we will meet in the next tutorial please stay tuned and subscribe to my channel thank you guys